Welcome to a short video on the passport assignment for ECE 441A 541A. Hopefully you found the course website which is on D2L and if you're on the course home page you can now click on content up here in this menu bar and that will take you then to a long list of modules. It's not as long as it will be during the course but if you want to see all of them you can click on table of contents and now we can scroll down through student orientation course business course resources prerequisites and review module the schedule module finally we get to unit zero which is the preliminary module in the course and if you now hopefully can see the passport assignment and you can fill this out either in a word format or you can do it on a PDF. If you now click on the passport assignment in the PDF format you will see this particular document will open up and the passport is really your passport into the class meaning it's going to allow me to know who you are by your name and if you go by another name or prefer to be referred to by another name I'm calling that your nickname it'd be nice if you could provide me with a pronunciation guide for both of those your email address and an up-to-date photograph then just so that I can lock in your name and face with you give me an interesting fact and that might be something you like to do, something, a talent that you have, some interesting fact that you think is somewhat unique to you that will allow me to connect these pieces of information with you as an individual. The next part of the passport assignment deals with learning strategies and these are all based or coming to us from a particular resource, a textbook called Teach Yourself How to Learn and that particular book is available at the U of A library and you can link to that. I've gone back now to the content page on D2L and right below the documents that possess the passport assignment you'll find the link to Teach Yourself How to Learn and if you click on that link you will get this page and now you can read this online and in the passport assignment I actually have you read some of these pieces of the book not the entire book just parts of it and then I want you to actually fill out a quiz or complete the quiz on D2L meaning now you go back to the home page on D2L and click on quizzes you should then see something like this on your D2L site and if you click on the passport quiz you'll now be able to complete some of the questions that are concerned with that passport assignment the last piece to this passport assignment is for you to actually examine and read through the syllabus which the syllabus is again in the preliminary unit and I want you now to read through that study that there will be probably another short video on the syllabus but I want you to go over that yourself and then as a completion for the passport assignment you can sign that but that's not so critical what I want you to do now is submit that particular passport filled out into the general assignment folder called passport assignment or it's in the category of general assignment folders submit that into the passport assignment and this assignment is due on June 9th. Hopefully those instructions will help you navigate through the website and the completion of your passport assignment. The fact that you upload 
that assignment into your particular passport Dropbox will be val validation or verification that it is you and the signature that is your signature by uploading that into the appropriate folder. I hope that helps and I look forward to meeting you as a result of you completing the passport assignment.